click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, we are going to discuss the comparison of TTL, CMOS and ECL. Let's start the discussion. So friends, we have the technologies that is TTL, CMOS and ECL. Based on the following parameters, we are going to differentiate all these three technologies. So we will start with the first parameter that is the components used while designing these three technologies. So the first part is of TTL. So components used while designing the TTL, the most important one is what transistors. In CMOS, it is MOSFETs. that is metal oxide semiconductor field defect transistors and ECL. ECL is a technology in that we will use transistors and resistors. So these are the components or you can say the basic components used while designing these three technologies. The next parameter is of what fan out. So fan out for TTL it is moderate you can say for CMOS it is highest and for ECL it is high. So this parameter fan out defines the number of outputs connected while getting the appropriate output. The next parameter is of noise margin. Now, if you see the TTL technology, the noise margin is moderate. For CMOS, it is high. And for ECL, it is low. So this defines the noise margin parameter for all these three technologies. Now, we will discuss the power dissipation per gate. We know that while designing the ICs, number of gates are used. So power is the important factor connected to the each gate. So we will discuss this parameter for each technology. So power dissipation per gate in TTL, it is 10 milliwatts. For CMOS, it is 0 0.1 milliwatts. And for ECL, it is 40 to 50 milliwatts. This is the value for each technology while considering the power dissipation factor. It is with respect to what per gate, designing per gate. Now, the circuit complexity is the next factor while differentiating the TTL, CMOS and ECL. So, if you consider the circuit complexity, so for TTL, it is complex. CMOS is moderately complex. And ECL is again complex. And the next parameter we are going to focus is what basic gates. So with the use of TTL, you can design the NAND gate. With the use of CMOS, you can design NAND or NOR gates. All these are the basic gates of logic circuits. With the use of all these technologies, you can design the circuit as per your application. And for ECL, you can design NOR or OR gate. So, with the use of all these parameters, you can differentiate TTL technology, CMOS technology and ECL technology. This is all about the comparison for all these technologies. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned with Ikeda and subscribe to Ikeda.